Changing a menu could help change an industry. Nikhil Nair and his NSF-funded team at Tufts University have developed a genetically modified yeast that can more efficiently consume a sugar called xylose. And xylose is the second most abundant sugar in nature, and it's mostly found in plant material that's inedible to humans, so things like corn cob, leaves, stalks. So th these are uh, uh, very rich in xylose. In our study, we found that yeast can be engineered to metabolize xylose very efficiently. Changing the menu for yeast from glucose to xylose can have a big effect on one industry in particular, biofuels, a sustainable alternative to fossil fuels that could support much of our transportation needs. But the production of ethanol for biofuels typically requires feedstocks like corn, which is fermented by yeast, and that can compete with the food supply. But biofuels made from yeast fermenting xylose would have virtually unlimited and sustainable feedstocks from sources such as agricultural waste or non-edible crops grown specifically for their high energy content, like switchgrass or fast-growing poplar trees. Nair says allowing yeast to grow on novel nutrients could open the door to countless applications. Yeast is not just a popular microbe to make bioethanol, but it's also important to make a lot of chemicals and drugs renewably. And so the uh, outcomes from our study can make such processes much more economical.